This is the last sub, uh, example for this subtopic. Example number three. The population in Malaysia is reported by the Department of Statistics and the data is presented in the table below. Estimate Malaysia population in the year 2012 by using the other Newton interpolation method. So now the question asks you for third order Newton interpolation method. So for third order, um, you must have four data points. So since uh, the question give you seven data points, so you must choose the best four data points. So now you need to estimate for population in the year 2012. And this 2012 is located in uh, between 2011 and 2013. So, uh, for this interval, 2011 and 2013, you uh, you must choose this interval in your data points. So your data points might be 2009, 2010, 2011, 2013, or 2010, 2011, 2013, 2014. So we have two possible uh, data points. So which one to choose? Which one is the best data point? So for this uh, four data points, this is the 2012 located between 2011 and 2013. So now you need to find the distance from 2012 until 2009. So the interval, the distance is three years. Uh, from 2012. 10, 2012, this one is 2 years. Okay, for this one, this is your 2012. So, 2012 to 2014 is 2 years. And this one, 2012 to 2010, also 2 years. So, for uh, you must choose the smallest interval. So, I think these 4 data points here is the best option to choose to find the population in the year 2012 by using third order Newton interpolating polynomial the next step is to write down the general form formula of third order Newton interpolation method so f3x equals to f of x0 plus x minus x0 f x1 x0 plus x minus x1 x minus x0 f x2 x1 x0 plus x minus x0 x minus x1 x minus x2 and multiply with f x3 x2 x1 x0 okay next step is to construct the divided difference table so to find uh, the estimation population in the year 2012 by using third order we must have the value of first difference table first di divided difference second divided difference and also third divided difference so in your divided difference table this is your x your fx first divided difference second divided difference and third divided difference so your x starts with 2010, 2011, 2013, 2014 and the fx value 
Okay, for the first value of divided difference is between these two values the next value is between these two values and the next value is between these two values so just use the formula of gradient uh, the change in y divided by the change in x so this one is 29.06 minus 28.3 divided by 2011 minus 2010 so this one, the answer is 0.76 and for this one, 29.95 minus 29.06 divided by 2013 minus 2011 and this one is 0.445. Okay, and the last value of the first divided difference, this one is 30.4 minus 29.95 divided by 2014 minus 2013. So this one is 0 0.45. Okay, for the second divided difference, for the first value between these two values here, the next value is between these two values. So just apply the same formula, uh, the change in y, 0 0.445 minus 0 0.76 divided by the change in x. So for the first value of x, so make sure you always go down, so it goes down until here, and then goes down, so the x value is 2013. Minus with, after that you must go up, up until here, and then always up, and then the x is 2010. And this one is negative 0 0.105. And the next value of the second divided difference is 0 0.45 minus 0 0.445 divided by. So the first x value, make sure you always go down. Go down until here and go down until here. And the x value is 2014 minus width. And then uh, the second value of x, make sure you always goes up. So it goes up until here, up until here, and the x value is 2011. And for this one, the answer is 0 0.001667. Alright, for the third divided difference, so make sure you refer to these two previous values. So, um, negative, uh, sorry, 0 0.001667 minus with negative 0 0.105 divided by, for the first x value, down, down, and down. So, the x is 2014 minus the, the next x value, up, 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 so x is 2010. And the answer is 0 0.0267. Okay. And the next step is to substitute all of the values in the formula of the order here. So now F3x is equal to F of x naught. This is x0, x1, x2, and x3. Um, so f of x0 is 28.3 plus with x minus x0, so x minus 2010. The first divided difference between x1 and x0, 0 0.76 plus with x minus this one should be x0 and this one is x1. So x minus 2010, x minus 2011, and multiply with the second divided difference between x2, x1, and x0, negative 0 0.105, plus with x minus 2010, 
x minus 2011, x minus 2013 and multiply with the third divided difference of x3, x2, x1 and x0. So this value here, so 0 0.0267. And after that, make sure you substitute this x value with 2012 since we are estimating for the population in the year 2012 so 28.3 plus with 2012 minus 2010 And then you just calculate um, by using your calculator. Twenty-eight point three plus one point five two plus weight negative zero point two one plus weight negative zero point zero five three four negative zero point zero five three four and the answer is twenty nine point five six okay so um the estimated population in the year 2012 is 29.56 million